For the first time this year, the FSAE boys are test driving a car they built themselves. Today marked its first trip out of the shop. Finally, the University of Hartford's Formula SAE team is finally testing our car on campus in a parking lot. It took a long time to get to this point, so it's, it's really nice to actually be here and to be doing this. Right now, it's running pretty good. Um, it's starting consistently, and that was one thing we were kind of worried about before, was once you get it started, it's, it's, it runs pretty much. But the starting itself is kind of a roadblock for a lot of teams at competition. Jake spoke about how he believes the car was running really well, and he was really happy with how the test runs were going. Right now, it's running pretty good. Um, it's starting consistently, and that was one thing we were kind of worried about before, was once you get it started, it's, it's, it runs pretty much. But the starting itself is kind of a roadblock for a lot of teams at competition. The members of FSAE built the car from scratch with no outside help. Throughout the year, they've designed, built, and tested the vehicle. If anything is wrong with the car, the FSAE boys can fix it. We had a couple issues last week with braking parts, but uh, as for today, everything's looking uh, pretty good. We've done a couple laps. Um, we're going to tune it up a little bit, make some fine tunes, and hopefully get it running a little bit better throughout the day. The FSAE team has a competition in Michigan soon, but due to COVID-19 restrictions, the team may not be able to be in attendance. I really hope we'll get the go. Um, the people that organize the event want us to go. They're, they're going to come up with guidelines so we can. So we're really hoping we can go because uh, we have seven seniors on the team that haven't gone before. Actually, no one on the team has gone to competition before. So we're really hoping we can this year. This has been Tracy Murray reporting for STN Channel 2 News.